Eight years ago today, we had our first official date, and each Valentine's Day with you since has only gotten better. You are my favorite person in the entire world, and I couldn't be happier to spend the rest of my life with you. You've made me a softer, kinder, and more patient person, and I am forever grateful for you. Thank you for always being patient with me, as I promise to always be patient with you, even though I may not seem like it at times. I promise to always respect you, and I promise to always love you for the rest of my days. I cherish you, our love, and our relationship, and I vow to love and cherish you for the rest of my life. I'm thankful that we've been able to grow together throughout the years, and I'm looking forward to what the future years bring to us. Thank you for always making me laugh, and I promise to always give you reasons to laugh too. Probably at me. <laughs> you are my best friend, and I promise to always be loyal to you. I love you with all of my heart, and I appreciate everything that you've done for me and for us. I can't wait to spend the rest of my Valentine's days with you. Amanda, as you're aware, I am not one for rules. However, in seeing that this moment and this day is so important, I read up on vows. As I imagined, um, there are endless and somewhat meaningless rubrics online to follow. Some say to start by explaining who you are to me, that you're my best friend. And my love. Most continue on to lay out what draws me to you the other way around. Your passion, your emotion, your selflessness, and sense of timeliness when I cannot manage to keep time at all. They say that you should use a story that connects the dots. Uh, my favorite story is us. That we're here, in front of each other, taking one more step in life, making vows. I vow everything to you, except to be on time, of course. <laughs> I vow to love you and to cherish you for the rest of our lives. I vow that this life is ours and I will hold it above everything that when time gets, when times are tough, I will be your support and your defender. And then when there is math, I will take care of it. <laughs> what it doesn't say is that I always questioned whether I'd meet someone that I would care as deeply as I do for you. That I've been making, I can't read a further. <sighs> that I've been looking forward to this day since before we knew each other. How hard falling in love was to accept. That it meant giving up control of something inside and trusting somebody else with it. But you are that person. Leading up to today, a lot of people asked if I was nervous. I am not nervous. I am sure. And that's what this is all about. Knowing that together with you, I am sure of everything. I pronounce them to be husband and wife. In the name of the Father, of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. And so, Mr. and Mrs. Williamson.